this is really cool and super interactive. Yeah. So this is Little People and it's so cute. But let's see, we'll play um play this mode. So this is really cool, right? So here little cow, he's gonna go through, make his little sounds, they'll recognize he's got his footprints, right? Cow's gonna hang out, we wanna get the pig involved. Little piggy goes, makes his little piggy footprints and tracks. And they can do something like feed the animals, right? And again, this is still in its prototype stage here. All right, doesn't want to feed right now, but we can open the barn door. Normally, you'll just open it, it'll react, and same with feed. It's giving me a little tough time right now with the water. That's a little tough. Mm -hmm. But you get the idea. It's really yeah. fun, and there's various modes, and it's also some learning, and it's recognition in terms of animals, sounds, activities. This is really cool as well. It does the same thing. Shapes, sounds you can draw, um, you can unveil. It's got all this play, but then also, when you don't have the iPad around, you still have a, a very helpful learning tool and toy that still involves everything. So that's why I really like this one. That's great. Because it's, it's still, and it's a completely functional toy, exactly, with or without the technology. So I think that's awesome. And this kind of has a similar feature as well. So I showed you, you know, it has the iPad in there. Okay. But then if you flip it and reverse it, it also has a mode where it just changes to a mirror. Okay. So it's functional with or without. Um, we've got all the free apps that accompany all the toys. And for instance, when baby hits this, it'll react. This, so it's teaching some, you know, positive reinforcement and, and learning there as well. Brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> They're going to be beyond.